morning guys just a, a very quick video really uh, I thought I'd give you an update I've just washed the car uh, I'm just rinsed it um, and I thought I'd show you what Fuso uh, soft 99 Fuso is like um, after five months Now that is what you call a good product. Now that's been on there five months and I've just come back from another road trip down to the southwest um, where it rained and poured all the way down all the way back on the motorway. Um, gave it a wash this morning um, and you can see after five months that for so looks awesome. I'm really impressed with that. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to dry the car and then I'm going to apply a topper to that and I'm going to put Soft 99 Mirror Shine on the car. Now this is a standalone wax but I'm going to use it as a topper. It was suggested to me by one of my subscribers that it's a great combo. Um, so I'm going to put, uh, put Mirror Shine on. So let's get the car dry. Let that van go by. Let's get the car dry and then uh, We'll put this on and see what we think of it. Okay, so this is this is it. It's uh, Mirror Shine by Soft 99, and uh, this is for um, dark paint. You get the application cloth. Got a nice little microfiber cloth for applying it. Doesn't smell of anything. Right, let's uh, let's put this on now. Like I normally do, I haven't read any instructions. Should be self explanatory, really, shouldn't it? That's quite nice to put on. It's not, uh, it's not grippy like some waxes are. spread okay so application wise not an issue now I think you can leave it for quite a while before you buff it off so that's exactly what I'm going to do I'm going to go around the whole car uh, and apply this and then we go around and we'll we'll buff it off afterwards okay so now I've gone over the whole car. Um, <coughs> I've got two cloths, uh, cloths to take it off and a cloth to buff it, which is the way I normally I normally uh, do this sort of thing. And that, I have to say, first impressions is very nice to take off. That's not like taking a wax off at all. That's not grippy at all in any sense of the word. So straight away, I like that. Slick. Not the slickest I've ever had, but slick. Now, as a standalone wax, I'll be pleased with that. Um, but to top the uh, Fusso, I mean that was that's extraordinary that that product. Um, yeah, I think I'm I'm set for the hard winter months ahead. The misery of January and February. Let's uh, let's carry on.
comes off very very easy I'm really surprised at that I mean with most waxes you find a bit grippy but this is not grippy in the slightest not hard work wasn't hard work to put it on and it's certainly not hard work taking it off I forget how much it cost I'll put a link in the video in underneath the video I think it was I don't know I got an idea it was less than 20 pound um, so yeah really happy with that wax on wax off just an argue really pleased with that that looks a picture right Let's see what it's like at the side I'll do one more panel for you and then so that I don't send you to sleep I'll do the rest of the car by myself and then we'll have a look around shall we oh I want to put some sealant on those wheels as well so we'll quickly go through that I'll put this um, on the glass of the sunroof as well as the headlights so it'll be interesting to see if that has any negative effects any smearing or anything that is lovely I'm really pleased with this product I can tell you That is brilliant, I love it. Right, I'm gonna, as I said, I'm gonna whip around the rest of the car and uh, put some sealant on the wheels and uh, we'll look at it, shall we? See what we think. Okay, before we go, let's uh, have a look at Mitchell and King armor. This is a wheel sealant. Now, you might have seen on a video uh, a little while ago I used it um, and I used it on a wet wheel um, and it works perfectly well but it's not supposed to be on a wet wheel it's supposed to be on a dry wheel so this time I'll apply it properly so I've got a clean microfiber you can either spray it onto the microfiber and put it on the wheel or you can spray it on the wheel and then leave it for a few minutes and then buff it off and that's what we're going to do so we're going to spray it on the wheel leave it for a few minutes and then we'll um, wipe it off and then buff it with another cloth so let's leave that for a couple of minutes and I'll come back to you okay go on there a couple of minutes spread it around You can feel straight away, you can feel the slickness. It's quite nice. I mean, I quite often use something like uh, Sigma or even uh, Bounce DDSI on the wheels, but this is, um, this is made specif specifically for wheels so it will resist the, the heat. And as you turn it over, turn the cloth over, 
and buff that comes up lovely pretty as a picture I'm really pleased with that the time I put some serum on the tyre that'll be the business right so there we go I'll do the other, four, the other three now well there we have it absolutely delighted with that mirror shine is absolutely the right title for that product I have to say that's probably one of the best products I've bought in a very long time as far as application on removal and looks afterwards absolutely beautiful really really pleased with it so there we go reasonably quick video there's the uh, the wheel armour that I put on, the uh, wheel sealant armour by Michelin King. Really pleased with that. Nice and slick, shiny, absolutely delightful. So guys, until next time, if you see me on the road you're going to need sunglasses, whatever the weather. You guys take care. Bye-bye.